And then for analytics, um, predictive, mm-hmm. uh, SaaS space. Yes. And, or you can do on-prem BI tools. Right. You could, you could use um, SSE for um, analytics like dashboarding, um, you know, what have you for, mm-hmm. for the presentation. And then you can still, because like I said, your data might be on-prem, you can still connect that to your, you know, cloud front end and make it accessible. So you're, you're basically, they're all um, helping you enable in the cloud, right? Whether it's application, data, processes, what have you. So where does all the really cool stuff come in? Is that going to be in the intelligent technologies? Well, the definition of cool can be yeah. different, right? <laughs> well, you know what I mean. Like, you know, the hip, the the uh, millennial, when do the millennial things happen? <laughs> in, in, in every pillar, actually, to be honest. Yeah. If yeah. you're if you're a developer, definitely the extension suite and the integration suite is your playground over there. Yeah. Yeah. So if you, I, if you look at if you look at data and database management, you'll see the DI, for example. It, it, it's such a nice uh, platform where you can do ETL as well as you can embed the machine learning uh, infrastructure to to train a model and deploy a model all together in a same pipeline. That's yeah. cool feature, in my opinion. Um, in UX, you can have um, if, if you choose to build. Uh, like build once and deploy many. Uh, you can opt for Fury design uh, in either UI5 or uh, even um, other platforms, as well as mobile platform capabilities like iOS SDK, MDK, and all this stuff. Even the low code, no code, as I said, uh, yeah. app driver and stuff. And, and, and the real powerful thing is also the, the, the main process engine, which is, uh, uh, coming out, coming out very strong as uh, SAP process automation, which is the workflow uh, automation as well as the AI capabilities are in, infused in that to to provide you a solid engine in, in the middle. So I would say in, in every aspect of it. Yeah, uh, I like the robotic one. Have some robots carry on. Yeah, so We've robot process automation is where you want you can automate a automate a business process, right? Like for example, there's a data entry that's like mundane. You know where to get the data and input it into another business process. You can do that with that mm-hmm. robotic o- process automation. Mm-hmm. Yeah, the cool stuff, like you know, as as an architect, for example, an enterprise architect is being able to connect independent systems and build a business scenario out of that. 